Hello guys, welcome back to my channel Math School. In this channel, I am going to teach you Karnataka Board Class 10th SLC Insert Math. In today's video, let us solve the question number 3 from exercise 8.2, that is chapter number 8, Real Numbers. The question is, find the LCM and HCF of the following integers by applying the prime factorization method. These three are the problems for which we have to find the LCM and HCF by prime factorization method. So let's start with our first problem. Let us factorize 12, 15 and 21 and then find the HCF and LCM. So let us factorize number 12. Always we have to consider the smallest possible prime with which the number can be divisible. So it is divisible by 2. So 2 6 are 12, 2 3 are 6 and 3 1 are. So let us write down the factors for number 12. That is 2 into 2 is 2 square into 3. Factorizing number 15, it is not possible with number 2. So we have to go with the next factor that is a prime factor that is 3. 3 5s are 15 and 5 1s are. So writing down the factors in the product form for 15, that is 3 into 5. Again, let us factorize the number 21. So it is not possible with 2. Let us start with 3. 3 7s are 21 and 7 ones are 7 so writing down the factors for 21 that is 3 into 7 so first of all after this we have to find the HCF so we have to see the common factor between all the three integers so 3 is common between these all three integers with the power 1 so since we for HCF we have to take the lowest power of the common factor since the power is 1 for all the 3 integers, we will take just 3. So the HCF for all these 3 integers is 3. Now coming to the LCM, we have to consider the highest power in the common factors. The highest, the power is same for all the 3. So let's, let's write 3 first and then again we have to write down all the factors which are not common. So we will take 2 square into 5 into 7. So let us simplify this. 3 into 2 2 is a 4 into 5 into 7. What is 4? 3 is a 12 into 5 7 is a 35. Now let us multiply, multiply 12 and 35 and find the result. 5 2 is a 10. Carry 1. 5 1 is a 5. 6 into 3 2 is a 6. 3 1 is a 3. So the 0 comes down. Adding 6 plus 2 is 12 carry 1 3 plus 1 is 4 so therefore the LCM for 12 15 and 21 is 42 and HCF is 3 now moving to the next problem that is 17 23 and 21 let us factorize 17 first we all know that 17 is not divisible by any number since 17 is a prime factor it is divisible by itself or the number 1 Okay, then coming to number 23, again 23 is a prime factor because it is not divisible by any uh, of the number. So again it is divisible by itself, 23 ones are. Again if you come to 29, again it is a prime factor. You can check it is not divisible by any number like 2, 3, 5 or 7 or any other number. So again it is a prime factor, it is divisible by itself or 1. So writing down the prime factors for 17 is 17 and 1 again for 21 the prime factors is itself and 1 for 29 again it is itself and 1 so the HCF for this will be what is common in between all the three integers we can say 1 is common right because there is no other integer that is common so HCF for any prime number HCF for any prime number will be 1. Then LCM is nothing but the product of all these uncommon factors that is 17 into 23 into 29. So let us multiply 17 into 23 first and find the result. 7 3s are 21. 3 1s are 3 plus 2 it is 5 into 7 2s are 14. Again carry 1. So 2 1s are 2 plus 1 is 3. So adding 
you get 1 here, 5 plus 4 is 9 and 3. So 391 into, again we have to multiply 29. So multiplying 9 first, 9 ones are 9, 9 nines are, it is 81, 9 threes are 27, 27 plus 8 it is 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. So it is 35 into 2 ones are 2, 9 twos are 18, carry 1, 9, 3 twos are 6, plus 1 it is 7. Okay, so adding these 3, 9, 2 plus 1 is 3, 5 plus 8 it is 13, carry 1. 7 plus 3 is 10 and this is 11. Okay, so LCM for the integers 17, 23 and 29 is 11,339. So this is the LCM and 1 is the HCF. Now moving ahead to the next problem that is 8, 9 and 25. So let us factorize these numbers first. Let us factorize 8 first. So 2 4s are 8, 2 twos are 4, 2 1s are. Coming to 9, again it is not divisible by 2. So we are going to the next prime that is 3, 3 3s are 9 and 3 1s are 3. So 25, uh, it is not possible with 2 since it is an odd number, it is not possible with 3 also. Now we have to go for 5. So 5 5s are 25. Again, 5 is a prime, so 5 ones are 5. So, writing down the factors for all the three numbers. For 8, it is 2 cube, that is 2 into 2 into 2. For 9, it is 3 square, 3 into 3. And for five, 25, it is 5 square. So, 22 cube into 1, 3 square into 1, and 5 square into 1. Here, again, you have to find the HCO. Here you can observe again that there is no common factor with, between all these three integers other than 1. So HCF for this will be again 1. So now finding LCM. Again LCM we have to take the product of all the uncommon factors because there is no factor which is common. So we have to take 2 cube into 3 square into 5 square. So multiplying and finding the result for this, 2 cube is 2 into 2 into 2 is 2 twos are 4, 4 twos are 8, 3 square is 9 and 5 square is 25. So what is 8 nines are 72 into 25. So let, so let us multiply 72 and 20 into 25 and find the result. So 5 twos are 10, carry 1, 7 fives are 35, 36 into 2 twos are 4, 7 twos are 14. So adding 0 comes down, 6 plus 4 is 10, carry 1, 4 plus 3 is 7 and 8 here and 1 comes down. Therefore the LCM is 1800 and HCF is 1. Thank you all for watching my video. If you like my video, please like, share and subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell button below.